Hey guys, it's a Deadly Kitten here. If you are new here, welcome. We do a lot of unboxings. Today is no different. Today we are getting into Fortune Cookie Soap. Now this is for the month of December. I know it's a little late. I'm a little late on everything because I completely space case through the holiday. Um, just so you guys are aware, um, there's been a lot of family issues going on. So... I've been having to deal with those, um, especially over the holidays. Um, I was supposed to go home and actually see my family for the holidays. That did not happen. Um, but yeah, anyway, we are getting into Fortune Cookie Soap. Like I said, this is December's theme, which is Once Upon a December. Um, I don't know if this will get posted before or after the 30th, but there is that. By the way, if you do not know what this is from, this is a Anastasia box. Oh, before that too, um, Fortune Cookie Soap is, I think, like $16.95 a month. You get four to six items, depending on if it's a quarterly box or not. I do believe that this is going to be a quarterly box, and I cannot wait to get into this. Like I said, it's about Anastasia. Anastasia is one of my favorite musicals. It's one of my favorite movies. Um... So, yeah. <laughs> so, this is the sticker that I got. It says halfway between where I've been and where I'm going. Because you always get a sticker every single month as well. And then let's... I am seeing a first um, in here. And that is fantastic. But I'm going to go with this first. This says key to your heart. This is a shampoo bar. Um... Mine got a little smished, but that is okay. Ooh, this is very florally. More, floral, more florally than I thought it was going to be. It smells really good, though. I just can't place the florals. So I'm going to set it like that. Hi, Kyo. So it says, ooh la la. There's love in the air with warm musk, fragrant roses, and fresh apricots. Pink pepper, light incense, and vanilla cedarwood. Cedar wood. This fragrance will definitely hold the key to your heart. So, I really like that. They're, like, when, at first, it just kind of punched you in the face with rose. And then it kind of, like, calmed down and gave you, like, that musky kind of smell. It was kind of, like, every, like, everything and everywhere at once, if that makes sense to you. The next thing in here is actually a first for this box. I don't think we've ever received one of these before, but this is a tea light candle, and this is in the scent Journey to the Past, which is one of probably my favorite songs. Mm. So this one, I've smelled this before, but I don't know what the scent is. But I have smelled it before. And I do love getting candles. I have only gotten one of their candles before in the past. Um, which was really cool because it was like a massage candle. So it like melts down and then whenever it starts melting, you use that. It's not necessarily wax, it's oil. So you use that to use as massage oil. Anyway, it says juicy pomegranate anise and freshly picked blackberries blend together with a soft dewberry and iris petals on a snowy trail of vanilla, sandalwood, and dark musk. Lead me home at last. The next thing in here, we got, this is a full size. I guarantee it is. This is really, really pretty. They went all out for this box. This is Perfect Beginning. Now, this is a bath and body oil. I don't think I've ever... I think this is also a new product. Um, this smells really good. I can't... I don't know what is up with my nose. I just... I can't place anything. Ooh, it leaked. It leaked everywhere. Now I have it on me. So there is that. Now we've gotten um, 
like hair oils before and face oils. I don't think I've ever gotten a bath um, oil before. It says, at the end, I want to be standing at the beginning with you. Warm musk and pink guava dance with fresh lotus petals. Mandarin orange and tuberose blossoms. They've eloped. Isn't it romantic? The next thing in here is another oil. Though, this one is Together in Paris. I'm going to try opening it up with the other hand so that way it's not necessarily. This is all oily. I'm not sure if that was like just leaking or not. I'm not sure. Ooh. This is really different compared to the other one. This one smells like raspberries. It's really nice. Not saying the other one isn't nice, but literally, I have oil everywhere, and I don't know where the oil came. Like, I know the oil came from this, obviously. I'm going to move this, though, just because I don't want this on my mat. Um, but anyway, it says, soon you'll be home with me once upon a December. A bright, bubbly champagne enchanted with ripe black raspberries, plum, and warm vanilla. Your heart will always remember this elegant fragrance. And then last but definitely not least is called The Curse. Now this is soap, slope. This is soap slime. So soap slime apparently together is slope. Uh, I shouldn't open it the way I did because now it's on the side. This is what it looks like. I'm just trying to make it so I can close this. Um, I got a little bit on my finger here. I can't tell you what it smells like because I have all this oil on me. <laughs> so I'm sorry. So it says, in the dark of the night, in the dark of the night, evil will find her. Dark woods and oud. I drag you into the depths of purgatory, crawling with strawberries and black currant while salty sea air whips around jasmine and sensual amber to lead you to ultimate doom but yeah so that was everything um my favorite probably smell of this whole entire box um is probably these two right here um i was really weirded out at first by the shampoo bar i know that but like the scents, I don't know if it's because of how it was packaged or how it is packaged or what. And that's why, like, the more you smell it, the more, like, different scents you start picking up, which is kind of cool. Um, but I really, really like these. I'm excited to learn because almost every single ones that they do, um, I always end up buying whatever the laundry detergent is in depending on the scent. Um, so I'll be excited to see what scent that they choose for the laundry detergent. I really hope that it is in um, Key to Your Heart. But I actually wouldn't mind it being together in Paris as well. So, or even Journey to the Past. So we'll see. Um, but yeah, that was everything that I have for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.